Louie, what's in the pool? A frog! We've got much excitement this morning because there's a frog in the pool. Look at him go girls, he's a better swimmer than mummy. How's he going to get out? Ranger John to the rescue. Good morning, it is Wednesday morning here in Orlando. It's about 20 to 10 and we are up in the car in our big minivan ready to start the day. We actually had a little bit of a lie in this morning. Well, I say we did, I didn't because I was up editing my video, but the girls and Ren had a little bit of a lie in. Ren didn't actually get up until about 20 to nine, so that was rather nice. And the sun is shining, it's a beautiful day in Orlando today, and we are off doing some really exciting and different stuff today. So I think when people come to Orlando, they automatically think, Disney, they think Universal, they might think SeaWorld, and they just think the big theme parks, but Orlando is absolutely full of smaller, more affordable attractions for the whole family to enjoy, and you can find like loads of details about this on loads of different Orlando pages, including Visit Orlando, there's loads of maps and brochures and things and all the different hotels. But we are going to be doing two different things today. So I'll tell you about the first one first and then we'll see. But we are heading to International Drive, which is very famous. It's a very famous, busy tourist strip in Orlando. And the first thing we're gonna do is we are going to go indoor skydiving, which is just hilarious. The girls are so excited, aren't you girls? <laughs> and John's really excited too. Unfortunately, I can't do it because one of us had to sit with Ren and so I, volunteered because I thought it would be fun for John to do with the girls otherwise it was just going to take too much time if we then had to wait for me to do it as well so it's just going to be John and the girls and they're incredibly excited aren't you so that's the first thing that we are going to do We're just sat watching another group do it and I'm actually really glad I'm not doing it. <laughs> it looks really scary. John's getting nervous. if you just like John, you're getting nervous, John. John just went, I need the toilet. <laughs> believe how brave you both were and what have you got there you got certificates wow. and bracelets you lucky girls I cannot you were so I don't think mummy would have done that you were so brave yeah little Rennie got a bracelet the man gave Rennie a bracelet didn't he that was kind of him so we've just left I fly hopefully you can hear me because it's a tiny bit windy and the girls were just incredible. I can't believe how brave they were. And they had loads of fun, didn't you girls? And John, John. And John, John. but yeah, John, daddy's a, daddy's a grown up, so he should be brave. And now we're just going to head for some lunch on International Drive. We're gonna to go to a place called Dave and Buster's just because it's nearby and it looks quite nice. And yeah, and International Drive is really good. I definitely recommend coming here. It's very touristy, but really good fun. And there's helicopter rides. Oh look, it's landing, look at that. Wow. Yeah, so it's very touristy, but really good fun. Well, 
we're having a sunbathe. So nice, isn't it? Little bit of sunshine. Hello, just, spider. hello, spider. We're just having a little bit of a breather in the sunshine before we go bowling. Spider, there's something behind you. It's a Ferris wheel spider. It's a Ferris wheel spider. Louie, what are we doing now? Bowling. Louie's a superstar bowler in this family. No, it's Louie Louie. We'll see. I think I'm going to be the winner today. I'm going to I know. triple figures today. I'm going to win today. The winner, the loser buys an ice cream later. What's your bowling name, Louie? Spider-Man. Spider What's yours, Mads? Mads. Mads. <laughs> What just happened? I was the first one to get a strike. She was the first one to get a strike. game of bowling at I King's won. Bowling, King's Dining and Bowling. It's just on International Drive and it's just a great way to get out of the sun and have a fun time for an hour or so. Who won? I won first and then Lottie won second. So Maddie won and then Lottie won and I'm not joking, John and I were actually trying our best and they, and they still won. Whatever. Um, yeah. So I was terrible. I'm normally okay at bowling, but I was really, really you're bad. Really, really good, but you're yeah, I know. I don't know what was wrong with me. I wasn't very good. Maybe I'm not very good at American bowling. Um, Daddy was the second third when I'm. So yeah, that ball. was lovely. And now we're gonna go and head to the, to the Florida Mall because Mummy has an obsession with Candy. Bath and Body Works candles, and I always have to pick some up. And then later we're doing something really exciting which the children don't know about yet, so we will talk about that later. recommended to try a place called the Wonderland Cookie Dough Company, is that what it's called? Yeah. yeah. And basically, you know cookie dough as in the stuff they have in Ben and Jerry's? I got candy. Yeah, and the stuff that is just basically the yummiest bit before they actually cook the cookies. They've got a whole shop dedicated to it with all different flavours. So we've all got a different flavour. Lottie's got Candy Monster, haven't you? Mummy's got celebration after the place we're in. Maddie's got mint chocolate chip. Maddie's got mint chocolate chip and Daddy's got cobweb, cobweb cookie. Mm. So it's so yummy, isn't it? Yeah. So I haven't said where we are and what we're doing. We're actually in Celebration, which is a little town, probably actually more a large village on the outskirts of Orlando. And basically Celebration was built in the millennium by Disney and it was to celebrate the millennium and Disney wanted to create this like 
perfect town where people could live in. It's very Truman Show-esque, isn't it, John? Like, all the houses look the same. They're all massive. They're all beautiful. They must all cost an absolute fortune. And we were reading about it last time we came, and apparently, like, everyone has to have white curtains at the front of their house to tie in with the effect and the overall look and all these type of things. But it's really beautiful. But then I think that Disney sold it and so it's no longer affiliated to Disney. And it's just a really beautiful town. It's really lovely to come and spend a couple of hours. There's a lake and a children's playground. And then there's a few different shops and restaurants. And it's just really beautiful. So what we've done is we've come here to have a little bit of a look around get some cookie dough because we were recommended it's new it wasn't here last time and it's supposed to be lovely which it is and then we're doing something which the girls it's one of their favorite things to do so we're going to go and drive past all the big houses and have a look at halloween decorations because obviously in the u.s they're so big on halloween and in celebration there's such big beautiful houses so they're all dressed up for Halloween and looking really, really cool. So we're going to wait till it's dark and then we're going to go and have a drive round and look at and see who can spot the best Halloween house. We're going to have a competition, aren't we? Yeah. To see who can spot the best looking Halloween house. We'll We've already home. spotted one, haven't we? Yeah, Daddy spotted one with a dragon and lots. A, a dragon and lots of things on it. So yeah, that's what we're doing. We found our first one. It's got a water feature. It's got a water feature with orange lights. That's pretty good. This one's pretty. Look at this one. We think this is the best one so far, don't we, girls? It's got music, pumpkins, lights. There's spiders on that one. Oh, look at that. That's really creepy. That's like a woman looking down. Look at the door as well, the front door. It's I think we've seen enough, haven't we? I think we have. Oh. <laughs> oh. Do your ghoulie impression as well, John. So it's quite a lot later on now and we've actually only just this second got back and we've put them all to bed. They're all pretty much nearly asleep already because you just get so worn out here in a good way. You know, it's so exciting and fun and there's so much to do that by the time you get back in the evenings, everyone just wants to go to sleep. And so the reason that we've been a bit longer is we went to celebration. We spent a good while driving around looking at the Halloween houses, which was really nice. It's really beautiful there I would definitely recommend going to celebration if you just want to like wind down and not you know have it so intense it's just a really lovely way to spend a few hours and then we decided that we would go and try and find Maddie and Lottie a squishy I don't know if anybody else's children watch squishies on YouTube basically squishies to me just seem to be stress relievers you know like I used to have one when I was a kid like a stress reliever ball and it seems that that's what squishies are they're just really cheap and they're quite a big craze I think on YouTube I don't really know Maddie was telling me all about it and anyway they wanted to try and find one because Maddie had heard that you could get them in Dollar Tree so we went to Dollar Tree they didn't have any so then we went to Target and they didn't have any so then we went to Walmart and we got them one so they're just the most random like I think they were like three dollars ninety nine or something really random little things but they're happy because they've got one each now but that took a couple of hours just because we were driving around and that's why we've only just got back and I have been trying to edit these videos either in the night time and staying up quite late or I've been getting up very early in the morning to do them because I don't want it to interfere with our holiday in any sort of way but tonight I am super tired I think all the excitement of the last few days has caught up with me and so I am gonna pretty much go to bed now as well and then get up early in the morning to do it but we've had such a lovely day again as always we're just yeah just it we're just so happy to be here and we're just having just the time of our lives so it's just amazing every day is so different but so much fun like the girls had so much fun skydiving today and then we just chilled out and went bowling and we're just having just such a nice and exciting holiday but I'm gonna leave it there and I will see you tomorrow bye